Hey there YouTube, uh, I'm here with my Sony Smartwatch 2. Uh, got it in from Clove a few days ago. I've been using it now, getting a little more user friendly with it. Uh, I really like it a little more than I thought it would originally. We got uh, a bunch of cool features here that a lot of people haven't really showed you yet. Got the alarms, which is nice. This flashlight's a lot better than you thought. Uh, got a calendar here, which is really cool looking kinda handy to have on your wrist um, some more stuff which I never really used before is this little finder app I'm not entirely sure what it does but I think it controls my tablet here somehow uh, does something but we got a little cool moon app right here that we downloaded you can scroll through a bunch of uh, stuff it shows you about I don't really understand most of it but you know and uh, this is a text reading application, which I have some uh, vocab words on here, which you don't need to know about. And we got a photo gallery viewer right here. It's like a, uh, call it a slideshow. I'm not quite sure why it's not doing its job right now, but whatever. Another thing we got here is a little Spanish to English translator. It's got a bunch of... Uh, uh, para, beer, 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 I don't really know, Spanish translations, little handy things. It's connected to my Xperia tablet right now, which is why I can't really show you the features of calling and texting, but uh, they work pretty well. They work actually better than my phone's Bluetooth does, so that's something I'll get fixed later. Pictures loaded here, they're actually loaded all along. There's some really pretty pictures we took this morning that I just uh, put my camera card into my tablet and now they're on my uh, watch here. We got my dog looking really good. The screen just looks excellent. I'm gonna be honest. It's really clear and you just see my dog running up here with a stick. Got some pretty sunset pictures or actually sunrise because this was at like 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. this morning. Uh, it's a little slow. These are some notes too but yeah, you can see text on it. You can, uh, this is a timer we got right here. Really nice. The weather is not going to load because I definitely don't have, but it'll try, but I don't have internet, so it shouldn't be able to, but we can give it a shot. But, uh, oh, it loaded. Look at that. You got your little weather right here. October is the date. It shows your low and the high. The temperatures, you got your three day forecast right here. Pretty handy with your temperatures, and that's it. That's all you're gonna get with the weather. But uh, yeah, calendar application which I don't use, but that's basically it. So hope you guys liked the video, and hope you guys like the smartwatch. Basically, yeah, pretty good. All right, so I'm sitting here at the gas station. I got my smartwatch connected to my phone now, so we got uh, text messages in here. And you can call back phone numbers right here with this button, but we don't really want to talk to him right now, so we're not actually going to do that. But uh, you can easily send back text messages, which I do a lot. You can send, uh, you got a whole bunch of smileys here. My favorite would happen to be uh, this goofy looking drunk guy right here. I send this message a lot. You know, when you don't know what to say to people, you just kind of send that. It's a lot easier than taking your phone out of your pocket when you get a text message. Uh, I got a few other apps that my uh, tablet doesn't. Another one is this. this is a view viewfinder for my phone. Wherever my phone is, it's looking through its camera right now. Uh, it's doing this backwards right now. I don't quite know what it's doing. It just took a picture, but uh, camera's not zoomed in at all on it. But yeah, basically, it's not looking really good right now. But my phone can be off, just completely off, and. The, my uh, phone's off back here looking at us basically and the uh, smartwatch is looking at it so I mean it's a little it's a little confusing the phone didn't even have to be on it's it's a cool little feature I don't think I ever used it before but you know uh, it's whatever but on here we have your like connection data I have my uh, battery life and cell service there and some of the same apps maybe got another text message what the fuck he's getting a little aggravated with that so we'll send him another message 
kind of just saying, uh, no Superman, no home. That'll work. That'll work. And I was going to show you guys one more thing here. I was going to give myself a phone call and answer it on the smartwatch. Just let the smartwatch do its own thing here. I'll let it turn off maybe if it wants to. In the meantime, I got a calculator right there. And there it is. You get a phone call. You have your picture in the background. You can mute it from vibrating. And I picked up the call by mistake. But we got this button here. I don't really know what it does. You go through your contacts. Uh, it's nice. You can go back through the phone. I'm still on the phone right now. He's just getting mad now. But if I can find my phone application in here somewhere, uh, then I can just go back here and end the call. So it's really handy. Really a uh, nice thing to just have, but that's basically all I got for it on here. So we got a little contacts book right here. Ready's gonna fall. And the calculator and my camera's falling. She just she just did that on purpose. But on the calculator, you got a keypad which is handy, and it's just not happening. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is only smartwatch two here, looking great, and that's about it. So subscribe for more, and have a great day.